My relationship with the Growth Hub is that I've uh, been a supplier to them in the build-up to the opening as a marketing and PR advisor, but subsequent to opening, I've been referring clients into the Growth Hub. I saw massive potential because, you know, what the county's been lacking for some time is a single place where people can go to for help. Um, I think, you know, when a business is growing, they're busy. Um, sometimes even they have difficulty identifying the needs that they have. So to be able to have just one place that you can go to and they'll identify what help you need and, and how you can best access that, I think uh, it's going to be a great thing. Um, it's going to be a huge variety of things, I think. Um, I think in some cases people are going to come here not even necessarily sure of what they need or, or what they want. Um, but what's encouraging certainly is from the ones I've referred to uh, the Growth Hub already is the experience has been very positive. Um, they found people very welcoming, very knowledgeable, very helpful, and also that it's a flexible offering. So, you know, it's not a one-size-fits-all solution. Uh, yeah, I think so. Um, I think, you know, all our understanding of that will grow, but if I think of the businesses I've referred, one was a one-man business, another one is a business uh, based in the county that's got £50 million worth of turnover, and they both had a need that the Growth Hub could offer, so it shows the breadth of businesses that can be helped. I suppose that this is just the start, and that there's going to be spokes around the county, um, and that you know the work in terms of reaching out to the county has only just started. You know, the team here have been phenomenally busy in terms of getting things up and running. But what's encouraging is they announced today, for example, that in the first three weeks they've had over 200 businesses through. And 61 of those already are in in-depth support already. So that's a fantastic start after just three weeks. Um, I think it's coping with growth because business is phenomenally good at the moment, um, but it's just coming in at a rate that you've got to make sure that in, in handling it, you maintain service standards to existing customers and give new customers a brilliant experience. So it's just coping with that and juggling.